Ivan Krstinich was born in 1953. He completed a three-year apprenticeship in wood shipbuilding at the Central School of Wood Processing in Novi Vinodolski. In 1970, after completing an internship at the Kamenyak Company, he came to work at the shipyard of Anton and Ivan Pichulian. By the way, the story of the Kamenyak Company is extremely important in the development of small wooden shipbuilding on the island of Rab, and its beginnings date back to the late 1940s. Namely, after World War II, the company Elektrovoda was founded, with its headquarters located at the site of today's Red Cross. The company employed masons, carpenters, electricians and locksmiths, and performed construction work. Elektrovoda soon expanded and grew into the Yadranka company, which added manufacturing to its list of activities. At this time, Ratko Spanyol led a wood construction shipyard founded by his father Josip in 1922, having arrived in Rab from Rijeka. The boats were constructed outdoors, where a supermarket stands today while a small workshop was located in what is today a FINA office. By the late 1950s, Yadranka was reorganized into a new company called Kamenyak. The manufacturing business was shuttered and shipbuilding was added as a new business activity. A skilled shipbuilder, Ratko Spanyol, transferred to Kamenyak and became its director. Shipbuilding soon became one of the most important avenues of Kamenyak's business. The boats made by Kamenyak were sold up and down the Adriatic coast and were regularly featured at the then very prestigious Zagreb Fair. The approach to construction was such that each master builder was assigned a project and had to complete the building of a boat from start to finish. In this way, each boat carried the signature of its builder. At the Pichulian shipyard, Ivan Krstinich worked for 15 years up until 1986, when he started his own business at his home in Barbat. I am one of the old brothers in Arab, who I started in 1968 and 1971, I started with a u početku popravak, pa onda izgradnja novih drvenih brodica, pa kasnije, nekde početkom 90-ih, taman kad je počeo rad, smo počeli raditi staklo plastiku. Moja firma je prva napravila na rabu kompletan novi po projektu, po mom projektu radnje staklo brod od staklo plastike. In mid-1995, he rents a workshop that belonged to the now defunct Kamenjak company and moves his business to the new premises. Seven years later, he built his own workshop in what is now the village of Mundanje. At the shipyard, he built motorized Passadas Type 800 and 860, sport and recreational boats Type Kvarnet 22 and Kvarnet 26, as well as the Kvarnet 26R model for fishing and passenger transport. He also adapted existing government vessels, mostly building cabins and installing motors. Based on the model of a wooden boat that he constructed in Barbat in 1993, Kartinic created a new boat, the Nautic 800. It was the first boat on the Rab designed and constructed in fiberglass. It was named the Milena and was built for client Darko Dedic. It was in 2008 when the famous Trošarina came, then there was a crisis and a little bit. But all the time came and we had to pay for it. Ivan Krstinic left a lasting mark on the development of the small shipbuilding industry on the island of Rab.